I can. Even though pain and heartache seem to follow me wherever I go, and though I try and try to hide my fears, they always seem to show. And then you try to say you need me. And I always have to say no, tell me why, is it so, I don't want to let you go, I never can say goodbye, oh baby, I never can say goodbye, no, 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 no. Ooh, oh, I never can say goodbye. Oh, I, I never. <laughs> good morning, y'all. Good afternoon. Good evening. And welcome to the mental house with me. Your host, Khadija, good to be back. And I just want to say, I want to send good vibes to everybody today. And those of y'all who, you know, are feeling like you're on the wrong side of the eight ball this morning, I wish you peace today. In fact, in fact, I wish you all the peace that you really deserve and that you're willing to sacrifice for, right? Um, Sometimes we just need to slow down. Sometimes we just need to, you know, look at where we're at in this whole scheme of things, right? So this ain't no um, commentary about the top 40 and no, um, what is it, gender or um, gossip. This is just a thought-provoking um, um, video, which which I hope for it to be. You know, and I just want you to sit back and listen to some of these proverbs. African Proverbs and see if they can bring some comfort to you today. Um, If you think you are too small to make a difference, then you haven't spent the night with a mosquito. Mm. No matter how hot your anger is, it cannot cook yams. Only a fool tests the depth of a river with both feet. That's what I feel about America right now. They just willing to split the baby in half, like uh, like the two women that went to King Solomon. Knowledge is a garden. If it isn't cultivated, then you can't harvest it. I mean, phew. think about it. And I just wish that this world wasn't so enamored and have to be um, gaslit by Europeans who are insane um, and not be able to take a slice of the whole pie of humanity. Um, the arrogance of some of the European is is just is mind boggling because if anybody can take a page <laughs> and should take a page from these proverbs, it could be a lot of them that are in your Congress, that are in your um, police force. Um, they could they could really learn a lot. Because right now they're they're totally dysfunctional. You know, a snake that you can see, don't bite. Hmm. Right? Love, like rain, 
does not choose to grasp that which it falls on. Check this out. Once you carry your own water, you will learn the value of every drop. Also, a lot of us you get into these situations or relationships and we uh, and with people who have hurt us, who have let us down, um, and we go into hate mode and just total resistant mode, not looking at it like the one who causes others misfortune also teaches them wisdom. And that's important. It's very important to understand that. Wow. Um, some of these proverbs, I believe that if we take them into our home and kind of um, focus on them a little bit, Get out of this European way of thinking, and you don't have to turn all African and that. She and I don't think that the Bible is relevant in some situations because it is. It's not just. It's not. I don't see the power in the people. I ain't talking about jumping around shouting hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. I ain't talking about that crazy shit. Oops, I'm sorry. I'm talking about something from within that allows you to move forward. For real, for real. <laughs> and let me tell you something else. This is a real good one. If your family does not sell you, strangers cannot buy you. Or will not buy you. The sun doesn't forget a village just because it's small. Mm. How about it? A child that was never shown love will burn the village down to fill his warmth. He that beats the drum for the madman to dance is no better than the madman himself. Can I get a witness? Can I get a witness? Oh, yeah. Can I get a witness? <laughs> Take a body. Oh, no matter how many times you wash a goat, it will still smell like a damn goat. Peace is costly, y'all. But it is worth the expense. Okay? And you might say, why the hell am I doing this today? Because somebody needs to hear this word today. Those of y'all who don't, See, but somebody needs to hear these words of encouragement today. I know it because I feel it. And that for that, I thank God for you. And I thank God that I'm able to bring it, that you can feel some comfort and peace today. So I think it's important. We stay so wound up on other things. So, you got to think about that. What is that? The bitter heart mm, eats its owner. Wow. Ooh. Oh, man. Whoa, 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 whoa. 
some of these things are so deep that upon reflecting upon them, you begin to see. I mean, you begin to see is the serenity and the knowledge and the truth in these proverbs. Okay? Just like that book that was published in 1619 um, uses proverbs and people think that's the original proverbs and where it came from the proverbs. Well, there's other proverbs. There's, there's other prop there's other proverbs. And um But I tell you what, I wish uh again a lot more things that we learn in school or whatever else give us the opportunity and the option to think more. And I mean really think in depth, not just applicable stuff, and to apply shit that you don't know where it came. But put it like this. Napoleon said history is a set of lies agreed upon. So we already know where their mindset is. History, according to Napoleon, is a group of lies. A pack of them. <laughs> just, that they've agreed upon and before they presented it back to the victim. Okay? So that's the position most of us is in. So you, what you have to do is you have to break that chain of thought. And I don't just mean breaking it by reading the Bible. I really don't. In fact, I wish that you would. I wish that you would look at some of these African proverbs. Because some of y'all, that Bible ain't doing you no good. It's just keeping you sick. And um, unfortunately, I have to just call it like I see it. With that being said, I'm going to go. If I get in trouble, I just wanted to make sure I said that today. And um, peace be upon you. I'll see you in the next video.